Hello everyone and a very good morning to you. It's a nice sunny day for a change. Today I'm going to do stage 47 of build the Trumpeter Titanic kit. Today I've decided to do the life bolts. They de definitely need doing all holes on there and I'll be putting them on the ship but I'm not gluing them on so uh, just want to see what it looks like the masts are still on there I've not took them off yet but they will be coming off soon for when I do the uh, diorama when I draw round the ship on the foam board once I've glued the foam board together which will probably be hopefully over the weekend I'm not 100% sure but at the moment I've already done one life bolt and I've got another so how many life bolts is there all together I think it's 16 16 life bolts I think but I've got some spares so whether I'll use all them is another thing because they always send spares in case you lose some but you can, can't lose these well there again anything's possible with me so anyway without further ado let's make a start on doing the life bolts okay I'm going to put some glue into my trough And I may be needing to open up another one soon as well. Get it out of the sunlight. So, let's check the instructions, see what's what. Right. So, for the H2s, which are these, these big ones, I'm going to need H5s. Which are these ones that I've already I've already painted. So I'll get all these off. Every one of them. I'm not going to edit edit anything out. I'm not going to stop the cam recorder unless I have a problem, which I nearly did. Then I nearly lost one. And I think I'm full of a cold. That's that one empty. And something just fell. I don't know what. There's something on the floor. Whatever it was, it'll have to wait. So, cut these off. And also, <coughs> when I'll be gluing the foam board together, I'll be recording that. I'll be doing it in here. But before I do any of that, I've got to saw down part of the support here. Because um, the foam board is just a slight longer than that. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. one on the floor already and there goes another I'll pick it up in a minute just trying to keep hold of them right, 
that's only uh, two more. Sounds like a big one going over. We get the uh, the A380 flying over here all the time. Just uh, uh, taking off from Manchester. Airport. Only paint underneath them, didn't I? Should have done. Never mind. Okay. That's them cut off. Easy on the bolts. Let's bring them over. They've all been painted. I've not painted inside. I don't think it'll need them. Army light bolts. So what I'll do, so you can see what I'm doing, it's time to put the innards in. Oh, I may have got the wrong trough. Very hard to keep hold of. Like so. La la la. La 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 la. Okay. That's not going in right. There we go. So that's two done. Wherever the other one is. So I'll just put that there. Uh, Two. A friend of mine was looking. Uh, on a site for wooden decking for the Missouri and it's very expensive but what I'm going to have to do is save up to get it because I don't really want to use Fablon again not for the Missouri it needs its proper wooden decking it's 200 odd pound Two hundred and twenty-four pound. Should have sanded that down. Well, that's three done. So let's get me little doings. Sand the extra flesh off. Peace. You don't, can't see much there, can you? I can zoom out a bit. So there's that one done. That's four. Next one.
so that's the other one done should be sending these off really I think this is the easiest part of the build. That's another nut. You know, it's a shame it didn't come supplied with the uh, oars. That would have been really good, that. I'm flying through these. Hope everyone had a nice Easter and bank holiday weekend. I didn't go anywhere. I used to do. I used to go away every Easter, camping. Me and me, uh, a mate of mine and his sons. We used to go to Cumbria. To a campsite up there. Absolutely amazing. <coughs> but I've no tent anymore now. Got rid of it. You know, I wish I did go away to be honest, but then again I've been away anyway, I went away in October, so the first time at the Isle of Wight, and, I'd, and it's going to be 20 years before I go back there again. Also, what I'll be doing, I'm going to put back on this video, well, photographs of the um, other builds I've done, the trucks. I'm not putting the videos back on of me building it, and it takes too long to uh, 
load and only that I've lost one of the videos so not much you can do with that that's another one done I mean if I knew how to speed my videos up I'd do it like that but I haven't got a clue I don't think I've got a program for it <coughs> but I'll just keep recording I'll have to put some more glue in that trough in a minute and I'll, unless it lasts And that's another one on. So we've got four left here and four left there. And I'm going to have to attach a davit back onto the ship that the uh, the holder that the, uh, the bolt clings onto because it came off by a wasp. Every time I open up my shed door, I leave it open. Guaranteed, a wasp flies in. I don't know why they want to come in here for. What a nuisance. And I can hear one now outside. But they always seem to manage to find a way in. Only two to go. Well, the big lifeboats, and then I've got small ones to do. I don't know if they if I painted the uh, inner yet. I have to check. If I haven't, then I'll have to paint them. Do it off camera. soon go off. Right, there we go. Perfect timing. Last of these big ones.
and there we have it all I'm done now so there's two four six eight ten twelve fourteen there so what I'll do I'll just stop recording for a moment and I'm going to check on the other ones to make sure they've already been uh, <coughs> painted ready to go in be back shortly okay it's telling me to make two of these ones here I'll just zoom in a bit a bit more making two of these ones and four of these but I'm waiting for the other one to dry off I'll zoom out a bit so I'll just glue these ones here going to be sad to see uh, this finished you know I've got another one to do but I can't start that until I get that wooden deck in so I'll get this part in here like so and I forgot to sand it down for the flesh again Always a bit and a bit of doing that. And while I was off camera, camera I had a sneezing fit. Oh. Once I think it's a fever coming back again. I used to suffer with that years ago when I was a kid. I always suffered badly with it. And then I was getting older, I took, I took some tablets for it and it stopped me from getting it for a long time. And I've not had it until now. Right, so I'll put this, this one in here. Just like that. Put that there. Now these are the wider bolts, I think these are the collapsibles so I'll get this in here I think some of the kids are still not going to school this week I think a lot of them go back next week when I was off, they used to go back at the same time sanded it down damn it oops a daisy the one's just snapped underneath so I'm going to be careful this there we are. so that goes in like so send it down A lot, of a lot of shouting going on from somewhere. Let's 
So, get that in. Are you in there? Just like so. Just like that. So that's two of them done. Just to make sure I put them in the right way. I don't think they have been. Uh, sand that down. Sand that. Sand that down. It's underneath that down. They both look the same, isn't it? Yeah, both the same. Okay, let's get the tweezers. I think the other one, the other one should have dried now. That just painted. Crate doesn't take long to dry in this shed. I wish oil. Well, there again, oil paints does dry quick in the heat. Takes a week to dry in here, but when if it's winter, it takes three weeks. I'm gonna do a painting in here in the winter. Oh. Okay, so that's that one done. So let's just check and just take the life bolts off here. Uh, screw cutters. Now the uh, what's it's not quite dry yet, so I'll just wait for them to dry. And I'll take these off first. And what I'll do. I'll start putting the lifeboats on the ship. So, just wait for them to, to to dry. That one and this one. Just wait for them to dry. I'm still a bit wet. Okay. Oh, the Okay. So I'll just pause for a moment. Right. Can you see what they uh, what they look like on here? I've got to be very, very careful though. I don't knock these off. Because knowing me, I probably will. And then it's a sod to try. Ah, long one. So, put one there, hmm. oh, what's these ones here, go on my darling, get on there, there's two, Three. You can see that, yeah. With this, I'll do put it in this one here.
see one of these things have already come off so that has to be re-glued back on eventually I get a chance to do it Uh, let's see okay see these small ones go in there like on there like that and that's going to be a bit awkward there's nowhere for it to glue on. Look, I've not put this upside down. No, I haven't. Right. Okay, so what I'll do, I'll put this one in over this end first. right there and the other one on top of that if you can see that I'll just bring it across one on top of this one here according to the instructions but I don't remember that being there looked at it wrong because this one I've just put on underneath goes up here goes there but with the, the lights being in the way it won't fit So that's going to be balanced like that and that goes on there like that. I knew I'd figured it out. And then I'll just do the same on the other side. So this one, another small one, wherever this goes, makes two of them which will go on the other side there and the small one goes on, it can't be the small one, it's got to be the big one it's got to be one of the big ones bloody things come off the davit see it's very awkward trying to get these in so that'll have to be re-glued on I'm only doing one side to show what the lifeboats look like. Uh, so I think that's stage 47 completed. Didn't take long. So I'll just give you a quick look round. Just zoom out. Bring the ship out. 
and like that, just undo this so you can see put that way where the life bolts are something wrong with this today I should have put it on my normal tripod so that's up there and the life bolts here excellent so I'd like as you can see the masts are still on even at the top end there but what I'll do once I've done put all the other bits back on that's fallen off I'll take some photos and put them on after the video well that didn't take long to be honest with you but them little davits that hold the lifeboats on they're very very fragile that's two that's come off now. One by a wasp and me with a lifeboat. But I'll get it, I'll get it sorted out. I'll get them glued back on. It won't be too difficult. But I'm not gluing the lifeboats on yet uh, until I've still got to figure out how I'm going to get the mylets in that deck. Because I need to get the uh, rigging on soon for the funnels. So, I'm not going to be doing it yet until I figure it out. So while I'm doing the foam board, that's when I can start thinking of uh, how it's going to be done. You know, I can't believe this is nearly coming to an end. But all the rigging's got to go on, though, from the masts to the deck. That's another one I've got to figure out. See where I'm going to attach them to. I think I'll attach them to the... Uh, the cleats but it's like I said in a previous video I'm gonna have to bring the other Titanic down and see that bring it in here get it done because that had uh, eyelets that came with the kit but there again it was by Harchette that uh, brought that model out many years ago and just think I'm doing the metal one as well so I'll have three Titanics I don't know, I've mean, even got uh, a Titanic in a bottle. It's only that big. Got that from the post office years ago. You don't see that anymore now. I'd say so, it's looking good with the lifeboats on. Really looking good. Um, so, anyway, I'm not going to prattle on as always. I don't want to bore you to death. So if you like this video please give it a massive thumbs up and if you haven't already subscribed please do so and don't forget to hit that notification bell for future videos. So until the next time guys, y'all stay safe, take care and I'll see you then. Bye for now.